Now, here in South Korea, AI and big data are being used everywhere to make life more convenient. Now, for personalized beauty services to find just the right makeup for each person and for personalized nutrition. Shin se Byuk went out to find more. Find out more. It's as simple as putting the tone measuring equipment onto your face. And whether or not you're wearing makeup, you'll be given a result that perfectly matches your skin tone out of 200 possible options. After that, this robot gets to work making your personalized foundation on the spot. How does all this work? The answer is artificial intelligence and big data. So this foundation is the one that the AI suggests would submit the best. Now, cutting edge AI technologies and big data analyze each individual and come up with hyper-personalized beauty items. The role of AI and big data is growing fast in the beauty and cosmetics field. According to the Ministry of Food and Drug Safety, the size of the global personalized beauty market stood at almost 43.7 billion US dollars last year. And by 2025, it is expected to grow to over $58 billion. To follow the trend, Korean cosmetics giant Amore Pacific opened its flagship store to allow customers to try its various products while also getting an opportunity to find the best cosmetics options for each individual. We recommend the best color matching for individual customers, not only through one-on-one -on -one consultation, but also by utilizing AI technology. Technology like this is also being utilized in the wellness area. Consumers fill in questionnaires regarding their lifestyles and health. Based on their answers, this startup offers personalized nutrition treatments to consumers using its own big data analytics system. All people need different nutrition because their health conditions all differ. We provide hyper-personalized nutrition plans to consumers using our own algorithm. According to an expert, the hyper-personalized beauty and wellness market could grow extremely fast due to efforts by companies to secure a larger pool of customers from the so-called MZ generation people born between 1981 and 2005. MZers are very well aware of what they like and want, so many companies try hard to make products and offer services that are tailored to each individual to satisfy them as much as possible. With Gen MZ having increasingly become the most critical consumer group due to their significant purchasing power, such services and products are expected to grow rapidly in the coming years. Shin Sebyeok, Arirang News.